What's up everybody? Today I'm going to do the app review on Video Downloader Pro. So, this app lets you download videos straight from the internet. And, um, so, like, if you like to watch videos on the internet or, like, the YouTube app, it downloads it and you, um, and then you come back a couple days and it didn't save it. But this app right here, it has it saves all of your videos that you download right here, and you can just watch them right there, just like that. But I'll stop that. So you can just download videos. So if you like a video, you can just download it. The only thing that um that is bad about this is that um YouTube has a copyright to these videos that are on YouTube, so you can't save a video that's on YouTube. So you can't save my videos. But, um, but at least you can still go on, because my videos do download, upload faster, download, whatever, they do, um, load fast. So, um, so this is just the browser part of it, you have this down button right there, that goes down, so you can have a bigger browser screen, you have your downloads for things that are downloading files, you can have different file types, settings, and info, right there, and then. Okay, so, um, it is kind of hard to find a, um, website that does have videos that aren't copyrighted, but I just did apple.com, so I like their commercials. Not Amazon. So, um, there's all these videos right here, and let's just do the iPad mini video. So, the video loads, the page loads there. So, the way you do it is just like you're going to save a picture on Safari, you just hold, you tap and hold. So, you just tap and hold, and then you get that box right there. You can just open, open your page, copy link, cancel, and download. So, you just click download right there. And um, you just choose a name. If you want to choose a folder, save. It says one that went away. Here's your file right here. And uh, they they go from newest to oldest downloaded, so it's right here. And it's kind of hard to tell which one it is because I just don't change the name. But you can also change the name if you want and make different folders for like ones like your favorite videos, your funniest videos, anything. Then you just click play. Um, right here you have this where you can select a timer for when you want it to stop. Um, you can, um, replay, shuffle, volume bar right here. And you have, um, go to the previous one, next one, play. And, um, I think it's just the one, just, I don't know why, but... I think it's just the video how it is right now. None of the Apple videos I have work right here, but they're none of them play for some reason. So I couldn't figure that out. But um, and I can't really think of any other websites that have them because most of the websites that have something, they're from um, they're like a length video from YouTube. Um, so it's kind of hard to find one. But that's just pretty much how it works. If you find one that work, uh, some ones that work, just click play, and you can play it, and then, so you can just watch them right here, and, um, but this is just the way it is right now, just with these, and then when you select one to play, um, you can choose a couple options, play, TV out, open in, export to photo roll, and send mail, so, um, those are the options right here. You have now plain, edit, sort. You can sort them a different way. So, um, you can also create a new folder. Like if I want to move these to a new folder right here. I'll just say, um, I'll just say name's iPad. So, I have, um, all... So now I have my new folder right here. 
I can edit it. And, um, well, I can move them. Just like, so, um, it's easy just like that. But, that's how you do it. So, um, this app is, I think, two ninety nine, which is a little expensive, but, <clears throat> um, you know, there isn't really a lot of apps that let you download and save a video. So, I think it's just kind of nice. I'll, also, right here, you have a search bar. So, I just think this is kind of nice. Just, you can download a video. Just, like, you know, just play it. Watch a video. And it's always there. You never lose it. You never have to wait for the time. Because I know on the iPhone and iPad, they do um, load pretty slow. But if you have it on a Mac or something, it does load faster. But this is just kind of slow. So, it's just nice to have it always right there. And you can always delete it, too, if you don't like it. So, um, it's really nice. Yeah. So, and a special thanks to Apps2B for giving me this app to review. I love this app, even though I haven't got them to play, but I'll, I'll get them to play. And if you find any apps that work, or videos that work on here, let me know. And um, so, this is the app review on Video Downloader Pro. Go check it out in the App Store. Thanks for watching.